YouTube, what is going on? For the past month, I've been meaning to make this class, and for some reason, I just haven't. There have been plenty of tack rifles and battle rifles that we have tested on this channel, but the one that I've been meaning to do is the SO14. Let me just equip a blueprint here, go to the firing range, and show you why. Like most battle rifles or tack rifles, it is a single shot by default. Those were not good shots. That's not really the point of this video. The point of this video is to show you that it's fully automatic. It can be absolutely nasty if you can handle the recoil. The best part about it being fully automatic is that there is a 50 round drum. Now it's not fully leveled because I'm lazy, but we're about to take care of that because we got double XP right now. Now all that's left to do is level this up and then go test it in Warzone. Oh, how I have missed you Call of Duty multiplayer. That was a lie, I have not missed it even a little bit. I've seen a bunch of people in the comments telling me it's very good. I've also gotten tagged in a bunch of videos and I've seen it as both an SMG and an AR, like a primary, secondary type situation. That was a great prenade, oh my goodness. And I forgot to change it full fire. There we go, full auto. The ADS move speed is not good on this build, but this is not all the way leveled, so I imagine that will get better. Okay, yeah, I guess you can wallbang that door. Ooh, oh. Level 84, what have you been doing, Draco? Of all the things on my bingo card, someone laying prone with a Bass P was not on it! So that's what I get for all the crap I've talked about the Bass P. But it's got really good range. I'm gonna be on it. Okay, not as good a range as that. What are you doing, Fear, with an M16? Why is everyone laying prone? What? I'll wipe prone now. There you go. Prone is undefeated. Alright guys, prone really is a cheat code, I guess. But to everyone who's like, Sally, you haven't done this SO yet. Or so, however we're gonna call it. Whatever we're gonna call it. We're doing it now. Yeah, you can prone on top of the tank all you want. I got the SO 14. Ouch. Now, I guarantee you someone's laying down here with a Bass P. Guaranteed. You think he's right there? Or you think he's in the hill? See you later. Oh, he just spawned there? Well, it's not good shots. These guys are all gonna come through here, I guarantee it. Three, two, one. Wow! That's just, that's two kills from the same guy back to back. Draco, go play, go play rank. And or turn off wall hacks, I don't know. And I don't know which way I wanna build this yet. Oh, I saw you up there, you dingus. I had to stay in there, I had to try to get the kill. But we're leveling this thing up pretty quick, so we should have a good feel for that soon. Someone really tried calling in a care package? That's funny to me. <sighs> this is not fun. Multiplayer is not fun. If you say otherwise, you're lying. Oh, now there's a chopper gunner. What are we gonna do? <laughs> I'm leaving. That's what I'm doing. Oh, great. Tarak. We got this. Yep, yep. Just YY. Tumbly Tim. <laughs> we'll be seeing you later. Stop stealing my kills. I'm trying to do this as fast as humanly possible. I want to play multiplayer for no longer than necessary. Not good shots, but I got the job done. Of course. Look at all of them! Took four people to kill me! Take that as a compliment. See you later, bucko. That's a new one I'm working on. Not buddy, not mister, just bucko. I do think it's criminal they put double XP weekend in here and then didn't have shipment playlist. The range feels good. That's honestly what I'm most surprised about so far. Like, I'm shooting these people through stuff. What are we at? Okay, I only have three more levels to go. We'll be seeing you later, Mr. Magoo. Nah, that's not it. That's not a good one. Uh-oh. No, I'm stuck. I'm pinned down by a sniper. Let me snake this. Oh! That was a surprise. I still don't know which build I'm gonna make for Warzone. Maybe we test two, maybe I try the short range one, because the best part about this thing is that it takes assault rifle ammo. So you don't have the same issues that you had with other attack rifles. Whoops, that's the wrong button. How close are we? Oh, it's done, I'm leaving. Now here comes the hard part. I gotta make the class. Class has been made and we are now dropping in. Apparently the one-shot sniper mode still exists. And while I love that it exists in the game, I'm gonna be awfully upset if I get killed by it. Take whatever frustration or rage you saw in multiplayer, multiply it by a gazillion. I will get up, I will walk away, and the video will just keep on carrying on without me in this little box. Oh, uh, what's in the box? I don't even know where to go. I guess wherever the rainbow is, I go as far away from that as possible. Ooh. Okay, it's over there. I also decided on a long versus short range build, but you're gonna have to wait because I wanna keep that a surprise. Let the drama and anticipation build, here we go. Haven't dropped port in a year, so we're gonna go there. Usually when that happens, I die early and I get upset, but not a lot I can do about that. I'm at the mercy of the RNG gods. Like, is there gonna be a gun right when I go in this big door? Who knows? Saw one person in front of me, and nope. Nope, there's no gun, cool. But I hear a crate. Ooh, orange crate, I'll take it. Orange grade with a crossbow? Guy just got the vehicle dipped. This big room has like no guns. It does have a boat. That's neat. I'll trade you a boat for a gun. That's not fun. I saw two people on my prox chat. 
and I can't get out that way. I'm trapped in the boat room. Yeah, I'm, I'm leaving the boat room. We're just gonna keep on trying to loot and then hopefully just get this thing quick. Hey, this is what I get for not going quarry, but I got another orange crate. Neat. Oh, a broadside? No, I have morals. What am I doing? Recon drone W, I'm about to throw that up here in a second. I'm gonna trade the crossbow for the wrap. Sorry guys, up goes the recon drone. Huh, no one should have perks yet. We'll park and exit and just keep looting. I still haven't found a plate. That seems very bad. Uh, if you guys could just go down in the comments and remind me to never drop port again, really appreciate it. Because there seems to be nothing here. Like, I've been in three large buildings and still have not found a plate. Hey, we found our first plate. Let's go. I'm being spoiled. Hopefully there's money in here and I can just go to the buy up there in the mini map. Oh, amazing. Can I go through this way? This was too long. I, I goofed. I goofed big time, guys. I thought there'd be an easy flank. Man, just didn't deviate from my head. What a dumb designed area. I have to go 50 meters out of my way to hit a flank. Absolutely never going there again. Think I'm going that way? You are wrong. I'm going this way. Well, I have no desire to go back to port ever again in my entire life. And I almost have enough money for a loadout because I got a lot in the gulag. Think anyone's camping this buy station over at port, or sorry, not port, Freudian slit. Quarry. I hope not. There's only one way to know, and that's just to go do it. It's been used. Someone's on my prox chat. Something tells me they're just camping up top there. Good thing I found a recon drone. See if I'm right. I knew it! Where are loadouts going? I might actually be off the scene here. Let me grab some supplies and I'm out of here. I don't think that person's ever gonna leave from where they are. I have two options. I can go back to port or I can climb this thing and then just go float to my loadout. And because they decided to only put like two buys on the entire map and never spread them out, there's not a buy anywhere close that isn't being camped. I guess I can go up to that one. That's what I'll do. The redeploy balloon would actually be super clutch right here. I don't know why they don't put him in the big map. They have him on Rebirth Island, Sheik Island, whatever. Sorry if there are any purists here. For some reason, they just decided no, the bigger the map, the less need there is to traverse it. And with that little cache, I just got enough to go get a loadout over here. So let me just slowly make my way over. I mean, with my luck, there's someone camping this one as well. There's a car right by it. And someone, oh, someone just floated off. They were like going that way. Oh, was that a person? All right, we got ourselves a little dog fight here. I don't know exactly where they went. If this gets stuck on top of the light pole, I'm leaving. Thank God. I went with a long range build. All right, now we gotta find this guy. I have high alert on. Connor UAV just went out, where is it? I don't see it in the sky. That's how I've always been able to tell. There they go. Oh, gotta remember to take this off single fire. That would have been bad. And they're streaking the buy? I'm not on the buy anymore, mister. Where did you just look at me from? This person's playing like a big old weirdo. And just refusing to... I'm not over there. Why are you throwing... Like, what? My biggest issue is I've never thrown this in... Or I've never shot this gun in a Battle Royale game. Hello? Where... I don't know where this person is. I can't see you, oh, back out in a minute. Okay, well, I think I found him. Nope, there's two people here. Where are you looking at me from? Guys, this is bad. There are no plates here, and now there's a jailbreak. I'm running low on ammo, and now I'm sandwiched between two people who won't move. Thing is, if I go out of here without knowing where they are, they're just gonna shoot me and I'm dead, because I have no plates. I don't really know how to play this, guys. If I'm being completely honest, I leave. That's the move. They're fighting. They're still in a fight. I'm gonna just try to loot for plates, because that's what I need. <gasps> Ask and I shall receive. I take, like, another one, though. I just like to have one in the back pocket, right? This lobby's also getting torched. I think this guy's still camping up here in this buy. Let's find out. 
No. Okay. I'm not in plates. And now I should be able to find these guys on rotation if I'm lucky. Yeah, they're still fighting over there. Let's go pay him a visit or die trying. A little bit of a bounce, not great. I'm just trying to loot plates here quick and we're gonna go try to find this guy. Bad news for them is they do have to rotate in. I mean, I have to rotate in too, but I don't wanna go too early and then just get wrecked. The fact that I heard coughing means that they don't have a gas mask. But are they this way or are they this way? I don't have the luxury to stick around and find out. I just gotta get in. I gotta say, so far, I've not been thoroughly impressed with the SO, and maybe I gotta try, like, a secondary loadout. But also, maybe I just suck. That could very much be it. But there's, like, no one around for me to even find. And now I'm getting closer to the rainbow where the one-shot sniper exists. So... Ooh, LTV, though? Oh, I saw someone right here. All right, well, I'm getting looked at in the back. But now I don't know where the other person was. And I'm out. They're, like, up here somewhere. Was able to get a stack of cash and a... Can't tell if that's up or down. Well, we're gonna just have to... Oh no, that sounded like a one-shot sniper. Boom. I'm just gonna have to try to take the top of the mountain. Find the one-shot sniper before they can find me. Did you have it? No. Well, it beat an ISO hemlock. That's pretty good. But that person was shooting down to the left at somebody. Now, where'd they go? I don't want to breach like the top of the hill if I can help it, but I kind of have like the God spot. If I can keep this top clear, then we're chilling. But that's a big F. Hmm, only 10 left. No way I'm alive. That person was just sitting right there? You flashed me twice? Oh my god. And now they're about to die? I just didn't expect someone to just be standing in the middle of the field looking at me. Freedom Banner, you're running through a mortar straight. Good. Gave me some closure. Now let's see if the one-shot sniper wins, because I think I still hear booms on the map. I'm not upset. I'm calm. I'm in a good place. Recon Daddy should definitely have known where this entire circle's going. Maybe just saw a sniper glint on top of a rock. But now you're in the middle of the, the poppies. And... That was tough. Those were tough shots. They got killed by who's our contestant? Kiki Momo with two kills. Boy. Signal 50 high explosive. That is not the one shot sniper, but they got a thermal. Let's see if these explosives rounds do anything. Literally just aim it two two a foot in front of them. The triangle in the middle of the scope is the middle. That's where you want to aim it. One guy high, smoke just went out low. Top of the roof, literally right in front of you. I'm so upset. I'm so upset I died to who I died to and how I died. That person over there should win. That's the person you couldn't hit with a sniper rifle. Yep, that's exactly what you need to do. Did they get that off? They did, but... I mean, guys, truly a special ending. I don't know who I'm gonna get now. The game keeps taking forever. The commander. All right, 13 kills. Someone worthy. Yeah, there's one underneath. No gas mask. Nice shots. Uh-oh. 1v1 for the win. The person should be on top here. The person that the homie couldn't snipe. Oh, no, they almost got that! I don't know. Who's, who's our winner gonna be? Lucky Mauler. Okay, so... When it comes to the SO14, I think it's so-so. I still think you're better off with other AR options, but if you want to switch it up and do something fun with it, here is the class. Let me know what I should be trying next. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you tomorrow.